Here at the Dice Lab we've explored a couple of different unusual shapes for the D6. First the skew D6 and then the slant D6. These are both fair shapes and of course they're not the same as the usual cube shape, but they're not that different from it. They're really both distortions of the cube. This however, the pyramid D6, is quite a bit more different. The shape is made from two triangular pyramids stuck back to back. Perhaps one reason nobody makes D6s like this is that there's no face opposite the one that's down on the table. Instead there's an edge. But that doesn't stop everyone else from making d4s that don't have faces opposite faces, so we just went for an anyway. Stick a number on either side of the edge and we're good to go. It's easy to see the number you get from almost any angle, including some angles for which it's hard to see the number on top of a standard d6. For example, it's much more readable from the side. Since there aren't any opposite faces, we don't have to worry about them adding up to 7, but there's something roughly equivalent. Each of the vertices on the equator has two numbered edges coming into it, and we can ask that those two numbers add to 7. We also balance the sums of numbers for the edges coming to the degree 3 vertices on either side. This one adds to 10, and the other one adds to 11, which is as close as you can get. The pyramid d6 rolls similarly to the other shapes of d6 that we have. It spends about as much time bouncing around before it settles. So in that sense it's not that different from a traditional cubicle d6. One last choice we made was the actual shape of the faces. These are right angled triangles. We could have made this with equilateral triangles or really any other isosceles triangle and it would be just as fair. You can imagine sort of stretching the die this way to turn these uh, right angle triangles into equilateral triangles. We tested a few different 3D printed prototypes with different stretch amounts to determine the triangle shape that we thought rolled and sat the best on the table for use as a die. Alright, this is the Permit D6. Thanks for watching.